There are many symbols of Kentucky, and in this video we are going to talk about 10 of them, from the state seal to the state sports car. But first, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, like, and share this video. To start off, we're going to talk about the state seal, the first symbol of Kentucky. In 1792, Kentucky became a state, and a state seal was created. The seal depicts two men shaking hands. The words Commonwealth of Kentucky and United We Stand, Divided We Fall surround the picture. The official colors of the seal are blue and gold. The next symbol is actually part of the state seal. The Kentucky state motto, United We Stand, Divided We Fall, has been the Kentucky state motto since 1942. This phrase has been used throughout history. It is most known from Patrick Henry's last public address. It is a great motto to have and speaks to a moral commitment to each other. It is a perfect motto for Kentucky because Kentuckians show this motto time and time again when helping one another when tragedy hits. Next we have the Kentucky State Flower, the Goldenrod. It can grow up to six and a half feet tall and has small flower heads. Each flower head is yellow. The Goldenrod grows all over the United States. The Goldenrod became the official state flower in 1926. Now all three of these symbols take up the next symbol, the Kentucky State Flag. In 1928, the Kentucky Flag became official. It has the Kentucky seal on a field of navy blue. The words Commonwealth of Kentucky surround it with the state motto, United We Stand, Divided We Fall. The flag has the state flower, the Goldenrod, on it as well. The flag has a unique history and an adventure of its own. I bet you can make a guess on what the Kentucky State song is, and you would probably be correct. Stephen Foster wrote My Old Kentucky Home in 1852, and the song was published in 1853. However, not until 1928 did it become the official song of Kentucky. The Kentucky State Bird is another symbol that's easy to guess. The Cardinal became the official bird in 1926. It is also known as the Northern Cardinal and Red Bird. They can be found all over North America, from Canada to Guatemala. The Cardinal is also the mascot of the University of Louisville. An old wise tale is said that when you see a Cardinal, it is a deceased loved one watching over you. The Cardinal is also the state bird of seven states. A lesser known symbol of Kentucky is the tulip poplar, the official Kentucky tree. This tree can grow up to 192 feet tall. That's tall and it is found all over North America. The tulip poplar became the official state tree in 1994. When someone mentions Kentucky, the first thing that pops into someone's mind is horses, and Kentucky has a state horse. And no surprise, it's a thoroughbred. In 1996, the thoroughbred was named the official horse of Kentucky. Thoroughbreds are considered hot-blooded horses, known for their agility and speed. Kentucky is known for horse racing, and many thoroughbred farms are in the state. Did you know Kentucky has a state insect? The honeybee is a worldwide species, but it's also the state insect of Kentucky. Honeybees make honey, and honey tastes great, so this is an easy one to get behind. The honeybee became the official state insect in 2010. Our last symbol for this video is the official Kentucky sports car. In 2010, the Chevrolet Corvette was named the sports car of Kentucky. Why you might ask? Corvettes are made right here in Kentucky in the Corvette factory in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Before we go, a question you might have is this. What does it take to become an official state symbol? The Kentucky General Assembly determines the official status of symbols for the state. The first one was created in 1792, the most recent in 2010. There's a total of 29 official state symbols or emblems. So if you have an idea of something you would like to make an official symbol, write your governor, representative, or senator. Maybe we need an official state podcast or YouTube channel. Just throwing some ideas around. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. If you'd like to support our channel, check out our Patreon page at patreon.com slash kyhistorypod or become a member of our YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, and hit the notification button to get more Kentucky history content. Find us on these social media platforms 
and check out the Kentucky History Podcast on these podcast platforms for more in-depth history of Kentucky. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.